Hey guys, so I've decided that I'm going to start doing book reviews on my YouTube channel and um, because I've finally gotten back into reading and as some of you know I haven't, before this I haven't read in years and this year I've actually read like six or seven books and it's been amazing and I didn't think, even think I was going to get to my goal of four books read this year but I have. I've been reviewing them after I read them on Amazon, BookBub, and Goodreads. Those are the three sites that I review them on. Um, I haven't, so I haven't done video reviews for each of them, but I remember what I thought about them because they're all from this year, they're all recent, so I thought I would do um, reviews for, for these videos and from now on when I finish a book I'm going to review it on Amazon, Goodreads, and BookBub and on a video for my YouTube channel. So. Um, I this is my review for The Jackal by J.R. Ward. Um, for those of you who don't know, this is a paranormal erotic romance and I regret my past in reading these books a long time ago, back when I was in high school I think. Um, and um, her books contain um, sex scenes in each book and I, I always skip over those parts and don't want to read them. Um, and But her books are really good, she's a good author and I love her character. She's the kind of author that creates these like male backstory, men that have really deep tragic pasts and I'm a sucker for those kind of books. Now I've recently made the decision, I made the decision a long time ago after high school to stop reading them so I haven't kept up with her books or series until I found this one and I bought it the other day last week for my birthday and decided to read it because it, it's, you know, a guy in prison and I can't just not read about a guy in a supernatural prison type scenario. Um, so I read it and then I started feeling convicted. So now I've made the decision again to not finish the rest of her series because of the sex scenes and in this case because of the cussing. The cuss words were absolutely terrible in this book. Um, so the things that I did not enjoy about it obviously were the sex scenes and the the cuss words. They used God's name in vain and bla blasphemed um, his name several times in this and they also threw a lot of f-bombs out and I do not like that and I finished it for the sake of because I wanted to finish the plot line but from now on I will not read any of her books um, because of that and it's really sad because I would really enjoy her books and I would actually be addicted to this series if it wasn't for those two bad things but on to what I loved about the book um, she has a really good way of with characters and giving deep stuff about the characters and I just I fall in love with them and um, in this like the deep tragic past they're the ones I'm a sucker for um, the main girl uh, her name is Nyx and she needed to find her sister and she ended up breaking into this prison met the guy named Jackal the main character and he helps her try to find her sister and that's what the goal so immediately you're kind of rooting for her and I wanted to find out if she find, found her sister and then I wanted to know more about why Jackal ended up in the prison and that's the only reason why I finished the story so it is a page turner and they do have a lot of good action scenes and it kind of makes you want to finish it to find out what happens personally I cannot recommend this because I am a Christian and I do not condone the cussing and I cannot condone the sex scenes either even though in a book you can skip them I still cannot recommend this to readers for those reasons but the storyline and the plotline and the characters are good um so yeah that's basically my review of the jackal um she had several twists in there um, one of them I was able to predict, no spoilers by the way, um, I was able to predict one of them and that was actually the big twist that uh, drove the entire plot line. Um, at the end though she threw out a couple more, at the very end she was kind of tying up loose ends and then boom twist are kind of thrown in there. Another one of those small ones I was able to predict but that one wasn't really a major twist but there was one twist at the very end that I didn't see coming that was just, it was amazing. Um, so there are, there is that too. Um, so yeah, this is my review of The Jackal by J.R. Ward, and I hope that you've enjoyed this little review. Um, if you have any questions or comments, put them down below. And um, again, I can't recommend it because of I can't condone the cussing or the sex scenes, and I personally am not going to be reading any more of her books. And I've decided to make that decision and not read her books or anything like them um, in the future. So thank you, and I hope that you enjoyed this book review.